ask you, well, there's vodka. We all heard of that, but uh -huh. you might not have heard of this green chili vodka. New on oh. AM Extra. Yeah, we're mixing up some summer cocktails that come with a little bit of a of a kick. Yeah, that'll take it up a notch. If you yeah. love Peppers, a distillery here on the West Coast has a couple of recipes that you will definitely want to try at home. Joining us live to walk us through some green chili vodka cocktails is Dave Smith, master blender for St. George Spirits in Alameda, California. Good morning. Good morning. How y'all doing today? Doing oh, we're great. Good. You, I was um, piqued my interest immediately. I was like, green chili vodka. Are we talking like like hatch green chilies? Like, what is this made out of? You know, I got a deep love for uh, for hatch green chilies, but we're actually able to source uh, uh, green jalapenos right Ooh. here in California. So uh, St. George Spirits, where America's oldest craft distillery, founded 40 years ago. We're in the Bay Area, and it's about a 60-mile drive to get to uh, our farm for uh, for green jalapenos, where we buy our, our green jalapenos. We've got red and yellow bell peppers here, serranos, habaneros. We uh, infuse all that in non-GMO corn vodka, and then we distill that with fresh cilantro and lime. So I want you to think about this, not just about heat, but I want you to think about that sort of fresh salsa fresca kind of kind of vibe with yeah, this. Yeah, OK, that sounds really good. So I'm really excited to check out some of these cocktails you, you have ready to whip up today. So first up, we're going to do the green chili gimlet. Talk me through this one. All right, green chili gim gimlet is going to be super simple. It's three ingredients. Uh -huh. We're going to start off with an ounce and a half of our green chili vodka. OK. So. I, didn't, I forgot to add my ice to my shaker ounce. first, too. OK. So we're doing that's OK. That's that's all right. Mm -hmm. It's just it's just morning drinking and it's fine. <laughs> I know when you start um, this early, you forget some of, stuff, you know, uh, it's 5 a.m. somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a five perfect. So an ounce, so uh, ounce and a half of green chili vodka. We're gonna use a half ounce of simple syrup. Okay. And if you don't have any simple syrup on hand, you can make it. It's just a one to one ratio right. of um, of sugar and water. Got a little. And take then a out of it today. we're perfect. And then we're gonna use a half an ounce of fresh uh, squeezed lime juice as well. Okay. Short on my and vodka. Then... Another half an ounce here. There we go. There we go. Okay, vodka. Right. There lime. you go. Simple syrup, all in the shaker. Okay, now I got to give it a shake. You got it. Yay! Now you got to yeah! give it a bigger shake. I want you to really get into it. Really get into it. Okay. I'm trying to watch your technique. Sometimes you know you do the fancy oh, stuff. I, I, I don't, don't get know. fresh with it. I I, don't, I, I don't. can't I can't make it that cool. I'm okay. Splash zone here. All right. Yeah, I know. Whoops. Okay, making a mess. Okay. All right. So we're gonna strain this into. A nice little glass. Let me get my vodka back over here. That's okay. Smelly. Yeah, I can smell a little bit of pepper. Nice and fresh. No, it truly is. That Ooh. is insane. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You want to get all fancy? You can. Uh, you can cut yourself a little bit of garnish here. Yeah, add a little. Uh, so herbs. just just a little lime peel on on it. And express. And Look at that. And I challenge enjoy that. Yours, yours looks fancier than mine, but mine tastes just as good. I'm yeah, not yours sure. is going to taste just fine. <laughs> That's great. All right, moving on. What do we have next? It's called a patio crusher. That sounds patio awesome. crusher sounds like the perfect summer cocktail. <laughs> yeah. So this is a cocktail that was invented by a gentleman named uh, Tyler Wang of uh, Boston. And uh, I was being served uh, near Fenway Park for, for, uh, for a while there. And my favorite cocktails, especially for the summertime. So we're going to, again, start with an ounce and a half of green chili vodka. All right. Yeah, do the big one there. There you go. I can smell it. It is. It's really and, fresh and kind of, like you mentioned, it's a little herbaceous there, too. It's not just straight peppers. It smells a lot different than yeah. I would expect. Yeah. Yeah. Or very good. Very fresh. Um, okay. You know, Pepper vodka sounds like sort of a dare. It's all about it. It should be a little, <laughs> a threat a little bit. about heat. And what we really want to capture is that we want that vegetal sweetness, all that green character. Uh -huh. um, next, the original cocktail calls for Aperol, uh, so uh, an Italian style uh, aperitivo. I'm going to use our St. George's own uh, Bruto Americano for a half an ounce of Bruto here. Half an ounce. Half so eyeball that one's sweet an and bitter that. Italian style liqueur. Um, and then I'm going to use a half an ounce of simple syrup. Yes. And then we're going to use, there we go. 
and then a half an ounce of lemon juice this time. Okay. You got the easy one. I have to juggle all these. You do have an extra ingredient. ingredient. Sorry. <laughs> I knew you could handle it. And then you got to do. I I believe in you. If you get here. So got one dash of orange bitters. One. Oh, whoop, there you go. Well, I didn't even make it in the thing. There. Oh, there. <laughs> and then we're going to shake this one up as well. OK. Oh. All right. And let's turn. Give us your best shake. Right. Ready? Here we go. You were almost in the uh -oh. splash zone there. I'm I was going to say, away. I should not have worn a white dress today. It's <laughs> no, dangerous. Not with an Aperol <laughs> drink. All right. It's cold on my hand, so there I'm you go. it's cold enough. Uh-huh. Give okay. a little strain out into your glass. Let's see. Ooh, pretty color. Uh, that looks absolutely. very refreshing. Lovely color. Nice light and pink. This is one that uh, my, my wife and I will uh, go to a friend's house and we'll show up with a, a picture of these, and no one is unhappy to see you when you show oh, up with a picture of patio pressures. Say, that very that is the move. I love it. Okay, so where can people find this green chili mm. vodka? Because uh, this is going to be a staple on my summer bar card, I think. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, so your local liquor stores, uh, we're, we're available. Um, and if it's not actually there, it's St. George Spirits, it's Green Chili Vodka, it's Bruto Americano, ask for us, we'll make it happen. Um, also, if you uh, go to our website, so stgeorgespirits.com, please uh, check there if uh, you have trouble finding it. We have a uh, uh, spirits locator on there and we can help you out. Ah, yeah. Very cool. These both look so fun. So Dave Smith with St. George Spirits, cheers to you. Thank you so much for joining us. We are ready for a summer cheers. afternoon. Cheers. Cheers. Joe, thank you so much. Thank Take care. you. And for those cocktail recipes, to find out where you can pick up a bottle of their green chili vodka and more, again, that website is stgeorgespirits.com.